Biological crop protection products effectively complement chemical products. They contain natural organisms or plant extracts which protect crops against pests. The manufacturing process of a biological crop protection product begins in BASF strain library at Limburger Hof, Germany. Here, thousands of microorganisms such as fungi and bacteria are stored at minus 80 degrees. In a first step, for example, a small sample of rod-shaped bacteria, which will later protect the plants against fungal diseases, is placed in a petri dish with a growth medium. After one or two days, the organisms have multiplied and are transferred into a small glass flask with a nutrient solution in which their number increases further. This is followed by a series of increasingly large fermenters. In these tanks, the microorganisms proliferate in a culture medium containing carbon and nitrogen sources such as yeast extract and sugar, as well as vitamins and trace elements. Stirrers ensure even distribution. Additionally, oxygen is blown into the tanks. In the last fermenter, which can hold more than 100,000 liters of culture broth, the microorganisms multiply until all nutrients are used up. The bacteria then transform into spores, which can survive for a long time without nutrients. The microorganisms are then harvested, for example by centrifugation, and then dried so they can be well stored. The final step is the formulation. The microorganisms can be mixed with preservatives, nutrients, dispersing agents, wetting agents, or filler materials before BASF packs and delivers the biological crop protection product. This improves their storability and makes the product easier to mix in water and to be sprayed. Now the time has come. The farmer can resuspend the biological crop protection product in water and apply it to the field, standalone or in programs with chemical crop protection active ingredients. Here, the microorganisms contribute to combating pests reliably and by biological means. BASF. We create chemistry.